Okay, so Danielle, you asked me if uh, you could use your painting for extra credit. You cannot use it as it is for extra credit. However, if you manipulate it in Photoshop, which I'm about to do to give you an example, you can use it. So the first thing you can see right here is you missed a little bit on the corners, either when you shot it, or I think it's probably when you shot it, your camera was tilted. So first thing you want to do is get in there and crop it just a tiny bit to get out those those uh, edges that didn't get didn't get completely solid. And so that looks pretty good right there. There is a little dot right here in the bottom that I miss. If this happens to you, you can just click on it with the healing tool and that'll fix it. Now, the next thing I want you to do is go to image adjustments. We need to get some more color in this thing. So you're going to go down to invert. Now, the colors are muted. The next step is this. Image adjustments, view saturation. And now change the saturation so it's all the way up to bring out some colors, more colors in your painting. Then after that, you get to choose the next part. But you just follow these steps. You can change the hue. You can leave it like this and save it, or you can use the slider to come up with a different color combination if you want to. Although I kind of like this default one the best. But then you can click OK. And now you save it again. Uh, I would suggest saving it with a new name. Like if you called this abstract extra credit, call this abstract extra credit adjusted or abstract extra credit too. 